my next spouse or whoever, when he come along, I want to be soft. When he come along, I want to be feminine. I don't want to be angry. When he come along, I don't want him to look at my YouTube page and be like, what's this? Oh, girl, you crazy. You All the ladies, if you feel me, help me sing it out. What's up, gang? It's your girl, Xavier, and I'm back at y'all with another video. Y'all, this video might be short, short and simple and sweet. <laughs> this is not a messy one. Y'all, I've been sending out uh, thank yous and apology texts all morning to, like, my sister, uh, my sisters, my close friends, and um, I sent one to Darnell Brothers, his little brothers. Um, now it's y'all turn. So basically, I'm getting up on it today. Um, to tell y'all, thank y'all. Like, my real supporters, not the ones that sit here just for the tea and being messy. I'm talking about, like, the real supporters who been down with us since Chicago. Like, my real supporters who been down with me since, since. You feel what I'm saying? Thank you. I just want to say thank you. Even the new people that sit here. I want to say thank you, and I appreciate you. Thank you for the kind words. I got a lot of kind words and sweet messages, like, from my day ones, from new people, from women who going through what I'm going through, you know. And all that's appreciated. You get what I'm saying? And I just want to get on here and say thank y'all. I appreciate that. That plays a major part in my healing journey because a lot of y'all brought me to tears, actually. <laughs> Some of y'all did bring me to tears by, like, even sharing y'all sharing y'all stories like i felt so ungrateful and so like uh because i'm like people is out there going through worse than i am but i just want to get on here and say thank y'all and i appreciate y'all for that and i just want to say thank you and i appreciate it for the day ones who still rocking with me and us individually on our own separate journeys also and i also want to apologize to my supporters I genuinely want to get on here and um, apologize to my supporters. <laughs> like, you know, it's okay to say my truth, but it's 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 a way, you know, you can go about things. And I never want my supporters to look at me like a way, you know, like y'all already, most of them already look at me as angry mom. Cause you know, that's all y'all seen and I, I, I want y'all to see me, Xavier. Like, I seen somebody comment, this is crazy. I seen somebody comment uh, on one of my posts and was like, you really do got a personality. And I do. And it was multiple of those comments. People was really on there saying, she really do got a personality. I do. Like, that's crazy. Like, you know, a lot of people haven't seen me as far as Outside the prints and outside the skits. Because even in the skits, I seem mad and angry all the time, you know? So, that was like my whole altar whatever. You feel me? So, it's just like, I appreciate all my supporters who still here and still rocking with me and still support me. But I also apologize for things being ugly and out of control. I never want child to look at me a certain way. Look at me like I'm angry. Look at me like I'm mad. Look at me like I'm mean. Which that is like my state. That's where I'm at right now. But that's not me. You know, that's not going to forever be me. That's not me. You get what I'm saying? We'll be deleting the... I'm going to keep the first video up when I said my truth because that was actually something I went through in my truth. But like as far as the other um, two videos, those will be taken down. Because, y'all, right now I'm looking at the bigger picture of everything. You know, stuff got ugly, some some things were said. I'm looking at a bigger picture now. You know, when we in the midst of things, you know, we tend to do things. Like, when my kids got to go through this, and they think they're going to go on, uh, uh, um, raise havoc on the internet and stuff, and then you try to talk to them, and what's the first thing kids say? Oh, ma, you did it. Oh, dad, you did it. Mom, you did it. You get what I'm saying? And I never want, I want to be able to, I know we're going to go through stuff in life, whatever. We gonna, we've we been through stuff, but I still want to be able to, when it's time for my kids to get these feelings and go through this, I can actually stand, stand on something and, and stand something and say, like, I lived and I learned. And you feel me? Like, 
I don't want my kids to have to say, well, you did it. Let me Google 2020. <laughs> Let me go on YouTube 2023, mom. But you, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I know some clips and some stuff all on the blogs and it's still out there. But, you know, it's not on here. It's not on my channel. You know, when my kids don't look back and be showing their friends, like, my mama was this or my dad was this. You know what I'm saying? So, I just want to apologize to y'all and say thank you to y'all for the most part. Um, also, like I told y'all, I reached out to Darnell Brothers and apologized to them because we trying to break generational curses. You feel what I'm saying? I never want them to look at those videos and be like, oh, she don't she don't mess with us or she uh, Z or Papa can't come around or we can't talk to Z and Papa. Like, no, because that's what I'm going through right now. Like my mom and her sister uh, divided me and my cousins, basically. Like, giving y'all the insight on, on my life, me and my cousins right today don't barely talk that much because what my mama and her sister went through. And I do not want my kids to go through that. I want my kids to talk to her. I want Z and Pa to talk to their uncles, talk to their cousins, talk to their grandmas and aunties and woo, 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 whatever. Even if I don't, I still want them to, like, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like my, my mom divided us. Like, if you, she made us pick a side. You feel what I'm saying? And that just give y'all a little bit of truth on my life. Like, my mama made us pick a side. I'm not making Z or Papa pick no sides. If you want to talk to your people on your dead side, go right ahead. You want to go over there, I'm taking you over there. You want to, they having a party, I'm taking you over there. Vice versa. Z birthday coming up. If I decide to throw her a party, well, I don't want nobody to feel weird, awkward, frustrated, or now nah, I ain't going over there. Now, nah, pull up. Come on, come on over here. This your, this your niece, this your cousin. You feel what I'm saying? That's why... I, I'm taking a step back and looking at the bigger picture. Auntie finna be 30. <laughs> Next year, hold hold y'all ponytails. Okay. Next this year I'm finna be 29 in April. Go Aries. But um next year I'm finna, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, she finna be 30, okay? Like I wanna move gracefully. I wanna learn how to control my emotions. I want to learn how to control my feelings. And funny story off topic. So I put an apology in my close friends. Cause I cause honestly I feel like I had to apologize to my my siblings and my friends because certain certain situations, certain things also take a toll on other people. You get what I'm saying? And I have a big I ain't, gonna, I ain't even gonna sit here and shoot the stone child like my sister at work. She said, people be coming up to me, they say, your sister crazy. Yo. And it's like, I'm not. Like, I can be crazy, y'all, but I'm not crazy. I can be crazy, but I'm not crazy. And I never wanna, people coming up to her and her job and like, they really broken up and, and I got a big, I got a big platform. You get what I'm saying? Like, what you do could affect, and we don't get it right away when we in the midst of our own head and our own BS, but what you do can affect people. And like I told y'all in my last video, how close me and my sister is, like, when I heard that, I was like, oh, no, like, like, you know, no, I don't, I don't never want to touch her, even though she didn't, you know, they be like, F them people, and, they, and I understand that, but then it's just like, I don't ever want them to, damn, every time somebody coming up to me about her or them, y'all get what I'm saying, so, I sent out a few, uh, apologies and told them like them videos is down i love them thank them for supporting me and i apologize for you know the embarrassment and um some of the things i said and you know stuff like that you know so oh i was going to say off subject so i also put in my close friends because in my close friends i have um some of my supporters but these are supporters who've been rocking with me since z was born like these is my these are my girls i talk to and uh, some close friends and family members up in there. So I had put, I apologize to them of the embarrassment. These videos will be taken down. What one of my supporters going at to my son? Uh-uh, why would you put this in here right now? I just ran over my baby daddy on my car yesterday and I'm gonna, I'm gonna put his business out on Facebook. I said, see, this why I'm doing what I'm doing. Cause, cause look at you. Move gracefully. You don't have to, I don't get no. I don't got nothing that she made me laugh though. She made my day. I don't have nothing to do with you hitting your baby day with a guy. But she told us, I'm gonna 
put all his business out on Facebook. Like, no. Y'all see what I'm saying? This is a prime example. And she ain't nothing but like 20, she two, three years old, younger than me or whatever. But no. You don't have to blast him on Facebook. You feel like <laughs> she crazy. But you don't have to, you know, move gracefully. And that's the that's what I'm on right now. I'm on healing time. I'm on moving gracefully. I'm on my Beyonce time. Like, what Beyonce say? Of course stuff goes goes down when it's a billion dollars in the elevator. And we still don't know what happened in the elevator, okay? So that's what type of time that I am on. But um, long story short, like I said, I just want to thank y'all. I appreciate y'all. Y'all know the vlogs going to keep coming. We're going to keep moving forward. We're going to keep, thank y'all. We're going to keep, keep rocking with me. And I'll show y'all some personalities. This child talking about some. She do got personalities. Like, y'all real life out there praise. Y'all praise. Tell me. <laughs> she do got personality. Like, it do. You know? <laughs> but no. Um. If y'all, if y'all or anybody else go back on my page, those videos will not be there. I'm taking those video, I'm taking those videos down, and I'm moving forward, and I'm on my healing journey, and I've been doing good. Like you know, people have people say like life don't stop and the world don't end, and it don't. I ain't gonna sit here and say like I'm a, a hundred percent my best, but y'all, I'm like getting my house together, blogging every day, and moving around and. Get stuff done and I'm okay. You know, I'm okay. It's okay. I'm okay. I am okay. I'm alive. I'm here. Like, I'm okay and I'm moving forward. And I hope another young girl take after this. I, this is who I also do it for. I have young girl supporters and I have other people, like I said, who told me their story in my DMs. And, you know, when people support you, they look at you. So, I don't even want one of them to up in one day and say, oh, I'm going to blast him or her or I'm going to go about it this way. And I just want all my women out there to be soft. I'm, I'm working on, I want to be soft, especially for my, uh, whatever happened to me, for my next spouse or whoever. When he come along, I want to be soft. When he come along, I want to be feminine. I don't want to be angry. When he come along, I don't want him to look at my YouTube page and be like, what's this? Oh, girl, you crazy. You know what I'm saying? I don't want that. So, uh, I'm here to say uh, I'm sorry to y'all for the way I acted. And I appreciate y'all and I love y'all. And thank y'all once again. I ain't doing a y'all but in the house. Y'all can see I just got out the shower. I'll use my pomegranate. That's how you say it? Pen pomegranate. What the fruit? Y'all know I don't know how to talk. Whatever it is, I use that, the dove, the maroon dove. Well, I use that, y'all. I'm smelling good. I'm drinking my wine. It's a Wednesday. I'm going outside tomorrow. Okay. So, y'all, uh, continue rocking with me. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. I love y'all. Turn on that post notification bell so you know what Xavier is on your screen. Period. Let's go.